I became a believer in Telepatriot very, very quickly. And now it's a really central part of what we do here in North Carolina. Convention of States Telepatriot, it's what we do. We love it, we get the word out, we get messages out, we talk to people who are like-minded. It's great. I actually use Telepatriot to make three-way calls between our supporters and their legislators. And I've even had a legislator or two pick up personally and I introduce the two and then I just sit on mute for a couple minutes while they talk. That's a pretty neat thing to be a part of. And that's why I'm a telepatriot. Let me tell you why I'm a telepatriot and why you should consider being one as well. I could, after I get off of work, sit down and watch the news and get mad at something new our government's doing to destroy this country. But instead, I'll throw a couple of burgers on the grill, then I'll make some telepatriot calls, and 10 minutes later, I have a great meal and I've done something great for the country. It just takes a very few minutes. It's so easy. It's so, so easy. And one of the things I like about Telepatriot is when we share the results of surveys done with candidates for school board and other positions. I did that with a gentleman over the phone one time, and a day or so later, he texted me and told me that he was so excited he was sharing the information with other people around his area and that he wanted to become more proactive as a citizen, much more self-governing. That's what Telepatriot does. That's what's so exciting about it. I need a Telepatriot call in the Florida Get Out the Vote Indian River School Board and follow up texted someone and they responded they were not aware of this election and would like more information. So I screenshotted the candidates' information and where they stood on the issues. And they thanked me profusely for sending them this information and we're going to get out and vote. So this is the very reason why I am a Convention of States telepatriot. Nobody likes a telemarketer, but everybody loves a telepatriot. You get thanked. So you call somebody and you think, maybe I'm bothering them. Um, and then they actually are excited and they thank you that they didn't realize what was happening within their area and that they can take action and you're giving them a really practical, easy way to do it. I mean, I spent most of my career in sales and I hated cold calling, despised it. Um, but these are not cold calls. You are calling patriots who are dedicated to what we're doing with Convention of States. They are yearning for something to do and you can give them hope. As a state leader, I like to use Telepatriot to recruit new volunteers like new telepatriots. I also like to use it to call my regional captains, my district captains, easy to use, fast, and quickly connect with those that are helping. Come out and join us, touch lives, get the important messages shared. We were all online on this call bliss, and suddenly she comes onto the, onto the online forum and said, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I just hung up on somebody. I think he's the son of one of the representatives, uh, Representative Mark Pless in House District 118. I, I got nervous and I just hung up. And we all laughed and we said, oh, that's great. Call him back. She did. She talked to him. It was a great conversation. He was going to say he was going to talk to his dad about it. Ultimately, Mark Pless did vote for the resolution last year. So come out and join us, conventionofstates.com, telepatriot. Be positive, don't get mad, and make a difference. Be a telepatriot. Make a telepatriot call today. Get involved. Come a telepatriot and help us win this country back.